Built for a very wealthy cotton merchant by the name of Francis Sorrell and his wife Matilda, this was the party house, and those gatherings would overwhelm this mansion so much that they would spill over into this square, which is Madison Square, named in honor of James Madison, the fourth president of our country. Now, this mansion coming up ahead here on your left, that is the Green Meldron House, originally built for Charles Green, Gothic revival style architect. Charles Green allowed General William Sherman to use that mansion as his headquarters, and he did that in an effort to save Savannah's face of the embarrassment being hospitable to our enemy. This is the mansion where Sherman was located when he sent the famous telegram to Abraham Lincoln, giving him the city of Savannah as a Christmas gift, along with 150 very heavy guns, plenty of ammunition, and 25,000 bales of Charles Green's cotton. Today, it's the parish house for the St. John Episcopal Church here on your left. Now we are about to take a left turn onto Jones Street, but if you would look over on your right, on the left side of the street there, that mansion where that American flag is, that is Mrs. Wilkes' boarding house, just in case you guys are looking forward on tomorrow to go and enjoy that Southern family style lunch that she has every day, Monday through Friday from 11 to two, okay? Uh, coming up ahead here on your right, uh, this is the Eliza Thompson House, completed in 1847. This was the first bed and breakfast here in the city of Savannah, ladies and gentlemen. Now, if you look on the opposite side of the street over there, the last building over on the left on the corner, that is... Uh, the first building restored here in the city by Savannah College of Art and Design is their Welcome Center and Admissions Office. But if you would take a peek at those little vertical cannons near the front door, uh, to give you a hint of what it used to be, it actually was originally completed for the Savannah Volunteer Guards Armory. Now, there's a photo opportunity coming up at this square, halfway around on the right-hand side of the Mercer House. Technically, we are not allowed to stop, so I want you guys to get your cameras ready now just in case you want a picture. Monterey Square here is named in honor of...